Dispersed and emulsified tramp oils have been known for years to impede the filtration of water miscible coolants through all types of disposable media filters. The reason for this is simple. Droplets of oil adhere to the filter media and form a waterproof barrier which resists coolant flow and causes the filter media to index prematurely. To demonstrate the effect of tramp oil on filtration and the ability of a high-speed disc bowl centrifuge to remove tramp oil and restore filterability to coolant, we have prepared the following demonstration. We first prepare a 10% emulsion of a chlorinated chemical emulsion concentrate in pure water. We will now remove two 100 milliliter samples of the freshly prepared emulsion and hold them in 100 milliliter graduated cylinders marked with blue tape. Now we add 10% of a widely used machine tool slideway lubricant conforming to ISO 68 and pulse blend it to mix it with the emulsion without allowing the formation of significant amounts of foam. A 100 milliliter sample of the tramp oil laden coolant is now placed in a graduated cylinder marked with red tape and the balance of the coolant is processed through a bench top sized high speed disc bowl centrifuge generating in excess of 4000 times the force of gravity on the coolant being centrifuged. A 100 milliliter sample of the centrifuged coolant is placed in a graduated cylinder marked with yellow tape. A laboratory vacuum filter has been assembled and the vacuum is generated by a positive displacement vein type vacuum pump capable of generating 20 inches of mercury vacuum. The vacuum pump is connected to the filter flasks with equal lengths of rubber hose and the flasks are fitted with millipore filter funnels fitted with Wattman number 40 filter discs which correspond to a tight 8 micron filter paper. To demonstrate that the filters have identical filtration rates, we will first filter two 100 milliliter samples of pure water. Next, we will filter one of the two samples of fresh coolant without tramp oil and simultaneously filter the sample contaminated with 10% tramp oil. And it is easy to see the tramp oil significantly decreases filter flow rate. We will now change the filter discs, replacing them with identical filter discs. Next, we filter the second of the two samples of coolant without tramp oil contamination, while simultaneously filtering the sample of coolant first contaminated by tramp oil and then centrifuged to remove the contaminating tramp oil. Both samples filter at comparable rates and demonstrate that high-speed disc bowl centrifuges are fully capable of removing tramp oils which interfere with filtration.